Welcome to the WCI Consulting presentation on Tableau dashboards. In today's tutorial, we're going to talk a little bit about creating a, a simple dashboard based off of three worksheets that we created within Tableau. So what is a dashboard? A dashboard is basically a creation of uh, workbooks into a single canvas that allows you to interact with that specific canvas and build out or interact and build out different um, adding images or adding web links and being able to interact with that specific dashboard. So on my screen here you'll notice that I've got three worksheets here and if you're not familiar with creating worksheets in subsequent uh, videos we will talk about creating individual worksheets. Anyways, and this first specific uh, worksheet I've got here, I've got sales by country. You'll notice here I've got a map of the entire globe and within here you'll notice I have filters for a year on date and then I also have sales built out for each individual region. If I click on my second workbook here which is profit by quarter you'll notice here that I've got a sales and profit uh, representation here by the uh, order date that's represented by a specific year. And here what I'm trying to do is that I've got a line graph with a, excuse me, a line graph with a bar graph. And the bar graph is represented here by sales and the profit is represented by the line graph here. And I've also got a, a filter here by the specific year. Now if I go to my third workbook here, which is order quantity by continent, you'll notice that I've got, I'm looking at the order quantity, uh, quantity by continent here by just looking at representing this by a simple bar graph. So in order to place these three workbooks into a single dashboard, what I'm going to have to do here is click on this button, this icon here, and within my new dashboard, I'm ready to dra drag and drop these into a blank canvas. The first one I'm going to put in here is the sales by country. Um, I'm going to make this tiled. So making it tiled will actually show up on the entire workbook here. And then I'm going to bring in my profit by quarter. I'm going to place this down here. And then my third one, order quantity by continent, I'm just going to place this here to the bottom right. And then what I can do here is that now I've got everything into my uh, dashboard. What I want to do here is that on the top right, I've got the sales uh, key or legend. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make this floating so that I can move this over into, um, into my actual specific uh, canvas. So in here, I'm going to place it here just because of the fact that it makes sense to place that legend here. And you'll notice that I still got my year of order date as a filter. Now what I want to do is that I want to make this dashboard more interactive. So I want, to, I want every piece of this dashboard to be interactive and be a moving fluid piece together. So what I'll do here is I'll go to sales by country and I'm going to add a continent uh, filter in here place that in here and then I'm going to select them all because I want every uh, I want to display all filters here. When I click OK here, I'm going to go back to my dashboard and then within my dashboard I'm going to add this quick filter or that continent filter into my dashboard. So clicking on this icon right here, I'm going to go to quick filters and then select continent and then I've got my continent right here. So the interesting thing now is that if I click on one of these objects here. Notice that it affects my workbook here, but my other two workbooks are not affected. So the way you can make this more interactive and make everything work together as one is by simply clicking on this continent um, filter. I'm going to click on the drop down and go to apply to worksheets and click on selected worksheets. I'm going to select all of them. Hit OK here. And now, she, now you should see that if I select everything here, my numbers change here at the bottom. So if I unchecked um, Asia, my, my numbers here have changed. And also my 2012, if I ch change that filter, you'll notice that there's a gap here. And then my numbers change here and here as well. Okay. So um, now in order to make this more uh, into more of a presentation mode, what you can do is that there's a presentation mode right here. And now this allows you to make it more interactive and you don't have the des uh, Tableau desktop showing up or anything like that. You've got that here and that's how you have a clean looking dashboard. So the last thing I wanted to show you is how can you make a title and then put in the logos in here as well. Well simply what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click on each individual workbook and within here I'm going to remove the title right here and then um, I'm going to create one main title 
by right clicking here on the dashboard, I'm going to rename this uh, dashboard sales by country for 2010 through 2013. Okay, And then within my dashboard, I want to show that title. So I've got my title displayed here. I'm going to move this down a little bit. And then I'm going to put in our WCI Consulting logo here. So double click on image, put in that logo. And then within here, I've got my logo. Okay. And again, that image is floating right here. And then I can just move that. That means I can move wherever I want. And I'm just going to move this, resize it here, and then clean it up a little bit. And now I've got my um, dashboard. And if I'm happy with this, again, I can go back to my presentation mode. I've got everything here that I want. And then what the last, uh, one of the final things you can do is if you're happy with your dashboard, you, you can actually go into the server and publish it. So simply within Tableau um, Desktop, you can go to click on the server uh, menu and then go to publish workbook. And then enter in your server information, your username and password, sign in, and then you're allowed to publish it. That concludes our discussion on Tableau uh, dashboards uh, by WCI Consulting. Thank you, and you have a great day.